We're back on Walmart Plus. Special birthday wishes going out here to a special nurse at the KNUSD Hospital, Leticia Ouswansa. This is from your darling boy, Kelvin Ouswansa. He says, I'm from you personally. So <laughs> <laughs> we, are sure. we are wishing you a very, 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 very happy birthday. Have a very beautiful day. Now, the players in the house. The main man himself is in the house. You know, I told him that he should help me pronounce his club because I want to do it with the, with the, with the German accent. So it is FC Ingolstadt. <laughs> Come on, well, attempt it <laughs> when we hand over to him as well. But help me welcome and introduce Hans Nunu Sape. Hans. Hi. It's so good to have you. Yeah. Hans, because what? You're handsome. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome. Oh, you're handsome too. You also boy. look pretty. Oh, Hans, oh yeah, yeah. did you hear that? You also yeah. look pretty. Yeah, she looks pretty too, yeah. <laughs> so, Hans, you're welcome to Warm Up Plus. Um, thank you. I mean, we do this every Saturday morning, and it's, it's the first time we're having you. Yeah. So, so it's a pleasure to have you. How do you feel? I feel good. I feel great. And mm -hmm. it's also a pleasure to be here. Uh, Amazing. Uh, hosted by you guys. Right. So. Now, let's, let's, let's just talk about how your, your season went, the, the, the last one. Did you enjoy it? Um, you know, f I, I cannot say I didn't enjoy the season because okay. um, the decisions are made by me. So mm. it's just that I, I was a little bit disappointed how it went, but mm. I, enjoyed, um, I enjoyed the season because I... I changed from Fürth to Ingolstadt mm. and um, I had um, one of the feelings I had wished um, for in, the, in football, like, you know, to have the freedom on the pitch, to have my confidence back and, you know, just do whatever I can do mm. and bring my qualities out. So I got this. It was, even though it was a short time um, there, I really enjoyed this short time, yeah. Mm. Mahans, you said you didn't like how it went. How exactly did it go? Yeah, you know, um, there were or there was a lot of misunderstandings, and also um, in the middle of my time there, I got injured, mm -hmm. and I had to go for surgery, and you know, and yeah, this was the most disappointing part. But it's all part of the game, injuries and. Yeah, things like that. Are and you fully recovered now? Yeah, yeah, I am. And <laughs> I, am, I am. Unfortunately, we, we, the team was relegated. So I would say um, I, I, didn't, I couldn't finish my job. Mm -hmm. I didn't have enough time. Right. But I think if I had enough time and I wasn't injured, yeah. we would have so, stayed. So you're, so you're going back to your parent club? No, I will would, I would go back to Ingolstadt. Mm -hmm. But... You never know what happens. Transfer window is, is just around the corner, so, yeah. No, but maybe you'll be the man to take them back. Yeah, maybe. It's, mm. For me, it's, um, um, it's not a problem for me to stay there. It's also, but you know, I just want to, if the opportunity comes, comes to, to progress. You yeah, know. but if not, then we focus on coming back. Mm. <laughs> Amazing. But um, let, let, let's just look at, you know, so this this season you you play for two clubs, if I should say. What, what was your time at Greta Firth like? And then the time at I mean, you've mentioned uh, quite a lot about about Ingolstadt and, and how it went. Yeah. But what was your time at Greta Firth like? Yeah. In the early part of the season. In the early part of the season was was um, was good. Mm -hmm. I would say it was good until you know in the Bundesliga everything is is way faster and mm -hmm. you know we lost games and it brought a lot of tension, a lot of stress. Mm -hmm. Um, we also had um, to battle issues with um, Corona and stuff like that. Um, even though during the time or the beginning of um, the season, I didn't play much in my position, which is number six. I played a lot in defense, which I can also play um, because we had our natural central three of them injured. Mm. So um, we need... Back. yeah. Right. And um, my in the in defense, I played I think five or six games in defense, and mm. yeah, I think twice in the in the midfield. Right. And it was it was a very good and great experience to play against some of the big clubs and you mm. know big players and. Right. Hans, yeah. let's. I mean, for for many of our our viewers who do not know who Hans is, just take us back a bit. How did it start <laughs> for you? Where did you grow up? And you know your journey through football. So 
where you are now. Just summarize it a bit for us. Yeah, um, I, I was born in, let's say, Jamestown Palladium. I grew up there around Jamestown Buko, mm. you know. Yeah. We you say nostalgia on his face. <laughs> <laughs> we say gamami, you know. Yeah. I grew up there, and um, I after school, you know, my mom wanted me to continue school, but I didn't want to continue so, so school. So when did you end? I ended up in um, playing at Liberty. No, so I mean uh, for for school. Education. Yeah, GSS um, yeah. Secondary GSS school. level is. Uh, Was she upset? Yeah, she was very upset. Like angry. Yes, very angry, very, very angry. It got to a time where she wasn't even communicating, communicating with me because I chose football. Mm. But during this time, I didn't know I could combine both, you know, football and education. I felt if I continued school, by the time I would complete, You're my friends would have, you know, me. left me. So I and. I think now she she's um, proud I chose football. <laughs> <laughs> because we've seen the results. <laughs> if we but had if it, not, then yeah. it will be Another a big story. problem. So um, my stepfather, may, may, may so rest in peace. I quite remember one day I came to, to visit my mom and he was like, okay, if you don't want to go to school, then I have two options for you, either um, Fire Nord or Liberty. And directly I said liberty, and he said why? I said, um, yeah, I, I prefer liberty to, to fire not. I said, but you don't know any of these clubs. I said, the reason being that I would be close to my friends, you know, because fire not is, yes, is far yes. away, and liberty is still, I will go and come back, and you know, about mm. um, and all these things. So I chose liberty, and. Mm. It was uh, it was tough in the beginning, you know. They had a very good, solid um, under twenty team, and you know, to break into this team, you need to you need a lot, and yeah, mm -hmm. yeah with um, determination and hard work, I was able to to get the opportunity to join the under twenty of Liberty, and yeah, at a point in time, I became the captain, and mm. you know, we we won some. Tournaments and trophies, and you know, it it, it was great right. during this this era. Yeah, mm. <laughs> I mean, still still on the liberty bit. Do you do you still watch their games currently? I mean, you move um, around a lot. I you think um, I, no, I have not watched not any. But any do you know game. where they are on the table? Yeah, yeah. I <laughs> I, <they> are, <laughs> I think you know. today today is the final game. The final game. Yeah, exactly. They are second That's on the league, on, league table on the with um, um, one point behind the. The first and my youth under so mm. I my fingers are crossed. Crossed. And hoping yeah, for a promotion. Yes. Today I'm hoping for a promotion. Tomorrow mm. I'm also hoping that Olympics will win, you know. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Olympics will win against Hearts of Oak. Yeah, because hey, I play hey, 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 <laughs> not, <laughs> not against Hearts of Oak, but Olympics uh -huh, will win. Exactly. No, it's, it's Olympics yeah, I know they are playing against Hearts of Oak, but Olympics will win. What are you saying? If Olympics will win, but not against Hearts of Oak, who is Olympics playing? And then Olympics will win Hans, at the end of the day. Hans, please your very carefully. So you are not allowed. But Hans, I mean... You know I played Olympics too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I know you That's where you're... So where's your heart? You know, I don't um, know. I I love I love um, liberty. Liberty mm. is in my heart very much. But yeah. um, believe me, I love Olympics <laughs> because of <laughs> such a because answer. of because of the fans. Right. And you the know, there's one city right beside you. The way they <laughs> insult and all those things, yeah. you know, I, I enjoy it. And I love the time I was at Olympics mm. from beginning till end. Yeah. Yeah, everybody, the technical team, officials, the fans, everybody. Was Are you still in touch? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I am. Think, I think we should, tomorrow. We should, we tomorrow, should I will be. I will be at the stadium. So. Oh, amazing. <laughs> amazing. And please, you better just be very careful about what jersey yeah. you wear, what colors no, you wear. No, I'm just going neutral. And you go with this one, black. <laughs> <laughs> and you are taking this one, so I will just go. <laughs> <laughs> just go. Um, 
uh, we should we should organize a, a, a Liberty Homecoming thing in, in Basuma. I mean, <laughs> oh, we should. And lots yeah, of people yeah, come lot, on board. A lot board. of yes. players have come through the Liberty. Yeah, yeah. true. Yeah. I mean, if, if that's, we do that, it's going to be. A, Even a hearing them talk game. about it, look at the look on Hans' face yeah. when he's yeah. just yeah. talking about yeah. his experiences. Yeah. No, Liberty is a, yeah. is a really really good club. I mean, yes. so hopefully they, they 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 get back into the into the Premier League and hopefully you know, hopefully. But Hans, let's get back to your journey. You've taken us through you know Liberty a little. What what was what after that? Yeah, after Liberty, I I. Went to Olympics, like I said. Um, during this time, Olympics was in the Division One, mm. so we played and went to playoffs and qualified to Premier, Premier League. League. And when we came back, um, I got a call from Reggae, um, Reginald Asante. He yeah, was also yeah. a former mm. player. And during this time, he was handling the um, Liberty Under Twenty team. So he called me and he said, "Hey, Paddy Charlie." <laughs> there is a tournament. Do you want to come and play? And I said, which which tournament? He said, yeah, some scouting tournament. I said, why not? It's football. Said, so I came and you see how the thing worked. It's not my tournament, but I came and I played. And from this tournament, I got the opportunity to go to Italy. Mm. It's but called then it. It's no magic. It's no magic. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> you <laughs> wouldn't understand what that means. You wouldn't understand. <laughs> but then um, during this time also, I was invited to the National Under 20. Mm. Um, and there was a little bit of um, decision to make between Under 20 and Italy. So um, we had um, a, a meeting with me, the coach, like, uh, Selah Stete and um, Mr. Giorgio Free and Mr. Anson. And um, all three said I should go to Italy. But honestly, deep down in my heart, I wanted to go with the under 20, um, the national team. You know, it's always a great pleasure and to play to for play them. To play for them. Yeah, but, but Hans, from yeah. the way you speak, you, see, you seemed a little reluctant to go out there. It was as though you wanted to stay, give back, and do all you wanted to do in Ghana. Yeah. So what was the final push for you to make this decision to leave? Yeah, you know, the final push was um, Mr. George Afri said something that, because he said, hey, uh, men drink too much. Because, who call Italy? Now, Konya Yekra, national team, they were home. there for you. But if you go with the national team and you come back and nothing, you lose you this. You miss out on that opportunity. So, in my mind, okay, let me. Then I decided to go to Italy for a three weeks trial. And fortunately for me, I, I made it and then came back and went again. Stayed in Italy for one year, six or seven months. Was it easy adapting? It wasn't easy at all. What were some of the challenges that you the faced? Challenge, some of the challenges, you know, in the beginning, you don't understand the language, the food, and... And that was going on. Yeah, the... Where is the coming? <laughs> <laughs> there is nobody around, you know, it was uh, me and the Italians, and so you can imagine when we have like three or four days break, I'm alone there, Everybody You're is missing gone. your friends. You don't have yeah, somebody. You know, but all these things, you know, made me um, made me tough and strong, mentally strong, mm. um, to continue my journey because it's always been like that, being alone and you have to you have to fight alone through. through yeah, it, it mustn't it, have been easy because last easy. week Colin Prepa was here and he was talking about how going to South Africa, at least he had Richard Ofori there. Mm -hmm. And so it was easier for him to... Yeah. Yeah. From the beginning, there was also one Ghanaian player, but when we came back for the new season, he left. Oh, okay. And then I was, I was, I was alone, yeah. And from Italy, I left to, to Germany. Mm. And then um, there were also a lot of stories, but we will cut it short. So I... Was it easier adapting in Germany? It, it was even difficult. Than More difficult than in Italy. More difficult than Italy, yeah. Because when I went there, it was in winter. And oh. Germany is more cold, cold than Italy. And you know, and when, said, I when I went... It's summer, it's summer. Yeah, it's and, very, yeah. yeah and w during this time when I went to Germany, I had no club. I went there to find a club, to search for a club. So... Wow. Yeah. So you have to go from year to year, from year You must have year. felt lost. Yeah, I was. I was, but... You but know, did you at least meet any Ghanaians? During that time, my uncle was there. I'm okay. um, not the one who played for Black Star. His older brother, he was there to to help um, to help me and yeah, and the agent who um, took me to Germany. In the so, first place. You know, just go from trial, trial from trial, trial from trial, and yeah, 
But the most difficult part is I never got more than a two-day trial. Every club who um, accepted to give me or hand me a trial only said one time one. training. That's yeah. That's so just one you opportunity. Have you have to give it yeah. your all. Mm. Yeah, so you have this one one chance and one time to to and every everywhere I went. That must have been a lot of pressure, and it, it wasn't. It uh, for me, it wasn't a, a, a lot of pressure because I made the decision to go. This My agent didn't do. want this kind of um, like this kind of trial. One time, what are you going to see from the player? If maybe this day he is not performing well, maybe tomorrow he can perform well. But they say one time, I say why not? Let Your me mindset. because I I believe in my in my um, in my capabilities and I believe and I know what I can do. So and you delivered. Yeah, I, I delivered. <laughs> but Hans, I'm seeing something on your on your shirt. Yeah. Well, what's what's that about? Take take me through that. <laughs> what's what's going on that's, on your shirt? Uh, that's my foundation. Um, I started the foundation, let's say, four years ago, but it wasn't um, official or something like that, mm -hmm. just helping people I can help. So it, it, um, I lost a lot, a lot because I had no experience okay. how to run a foundation or manage things. And behind, behind my head is like helping somebody. And, you That's know, the dream, but how mm, to implement like the it. little ones and until last, uh, I would say, let's say two and a half years, I met um, the manager of all managers, Mr. Thomas Soti. Mm. Uh, and he walked me through and helped me. As, um, I'm very grateful mm. um, for him, for all the efforts and he all the sacrifices that um, he, he's been doing. So we Manas, we're seeing some pictures being displayed on the screen currently. Can you talk us through that? What exactly was happening? Yeah, I've seen some know, familiar faces in the studio as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, um, I, I have, um, let's say, a connection with um, the, um, the ambassador from, for Germany and Ghana. So every time the season ends, we come and go pay them a visit. And, okay. You know, so this one is, um, we went there to um, personally or personally, officially invite the ambassador to my program yesterday, um, the 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 gala um, mm. donation, okay. this thing, and they they have also been very good to us. Mm. And yeah, yesterday he was there, and for me it was a pleasure to to. The have jersey him. looks really sweet, and this one <laughs> I think <laughs> maybe now I support <laughs> FC Ingolstadt. Yes, <laughs> Definitely, show, I have to take you it have to. I'll <laughs> take it and then get another jersey for myself and move on. You would say I know somebody will take the the, <laughs> the, 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 the shirt from me because I have something under it. Yeah. yeah. What, what makes you think we will not take what's underneath it? Too? <laughs> <laughs> not be, what's, don't what's be underneath it. It's just it's just. Um, <laughs> okay, but Hans, before we go, I just want you to to wrap up any last words to your fans out there, to young players who also want to break out into the big scene. Any words of advice? Any, anything for your fans before we leave? Yeah, um, I would like to say um, a big thank you to everybody who has been there for me, um, both physically and spiritually, when I was in my difficult times, and those who have also been there throughout from the beginning till now. Like I said, um, I will thank um, Stark mm. for, for, for everything because... Champion Stark. At at every given time, he is there. He has, I would say, he has made um, most part, most of the job easier for every me. Every given time, even yeah. now. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, yeah. I would also to my family. I'm mm. grateful that they have been there through thick and thin, and my my friends also close to me. Um, if I, the list is long, but to Gamashi, try Gamashi. To, yeah, the Gamashi people Representing. are always there. <laughs> um, a very big thank you to once again to uh, Mr. Herge for the um, a deputy ambassador mm. for the German um, German Ghana Embassy for coming to support my um, program yesterday. Mm. Um, to Mr. Tony Bafo, the general secretary mm. of PFAG, yeah. he was also there. And um, the MP for, I think, Odododio constituency, Mr. Mm. Neil Ante Van der Poel, yeah. he was also there. Right. They were all there to help me, Regina Dasanti, mm. everybody, my, my, my close friends. Um, uh, I would say those who also are at home and 
support Watching. him in whichever way yeah. um, they they want to, As, um, to just 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 before we go though mm -hmm. your social media handles let's let's follow let's you. follow up let let's our follow viewers up. follow you on social media yeah. um uh, see what's happening with you so your instagram your twitter the facebook yeah whatever. instagram is um, let me even get ready it's um warrior king warrior, warrior king. king 18 warrior king. with this there's an underscore yeah, with the underscore. Okay. So warrior underscore king. Warrior underscore king, king eighteen. 18. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Right. And um, Twitter is mm. Hansape. Mm. I found it. Um, okay. Follow. Yeah. So so <laughs> so so um, Instagram is warrior. Facebook is also Hans Nunu Sape. Right. Yeah. Okay. And, okay. Um, but, but I know you love Instagram. Yeah, yeah, like you are I mostly do. on Instagram. Yeah, so we have 265 so posts. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be liking all of them later today. <laughs> but thank you so much, Hanska. Yeah. Oh, I think footballers, um, they have their PDF. One person, if I don't mention his name, he's going to kill me. Um, his name is called OJ. Mm. OJ. OJ, yeah. Mm. Because if I don't mention this name, OJ, I thank you very much. <laughs> OJ, shout out. You know, we're giving you. Wise, everybody. Mom will be. In, New town voice, mm. um, everybody. Footballers, they have the PDF, they're always yeah. ready with yeah, the yeah, thanks. Yeah, and yeah, it's, it's, I mean, it's, it's beautiful. There's to a lot of back. people you need to thank along yeah, the way. And yeah. for footballers, you know, they, they meet, always do it. Yeah, they they always do it. Hans Charlie, it was an honor to have you here. We'll be communicating on the. But don't forget, don't forget to follow Hans on Instagram. It's warrior underscore king eighteen. Follow him and then. Uh, just enjoy some posts. We are taking a break. When we come back, though, there's more here on Warmer Plus okay. right here on TV3. Stay with us. Okay. Thank you.